First on five, a Mobile County man killed in an ATV accident. This happened near the Alabama Mississippi state line and WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones went out to the scene today. He joins us in the studio tonight. Jeremy, you spoke with the man's fiance and he also leaves behind young children. Dana, she tells me she's not ready to go on camera yet, but share these pictures of their young family. This is 26 year old Chase Zuber. His fiance Sydney says they have a five month old daughter and four year old son. Mobile County deputies say witnesses report seeing Zuber on the passenger side of an ATV trying to stop the driver from leaving. That's when investigators say Zuber tried to grab the keys of the ignition and the driver turned the ATV, causing it to flip and land on top of him. Deputies say witnesses removed the ATV off Zuber, but he was dead when investigators arrived. The sheriff's office is calling the death an accident. We spoke with a man who lives across the street who heard a helicopter and emergency vehicles. And uh, I judge by the ratio of um, the emergency vehicles to police personnel that there must have been an accident. I got on the phone tried to call neighbors to get information and none of them answered. So I was left wondering what was going on. Zuber's fiance, Sydney Meyer, says he was an amazing father and the love of her life. She sent us this statement saying in part, I can't imagine what life looks like moving forward, but I know he's watching over all of us. She went on to say, I am heartbroken and my only goal now is to make sure our daughter Riker and our daughter Ann Riker knows what an amazing, great man their father was. Reporting in studio, Jamie Jones, WKRG News 5.